Hey what's going on guys, welcome back to the channel, time to talk a tweaks for those who already jailbreak their devices on iOS 13, 13.5, 13.7, even iOS 14 up to 14.1 and also iOS 14.2, those CD tweaks will be for you. So before I'm gonna be start today's video, let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a new CD at Weeks video. All right, so let's go ahead right now to start talking about today's tweaks. And number one on my list will be the DOS key. This tweak, once you install it in your jailbroken device, will be make you to reduce the transparency in select element. So, for example, to show you guys, if I want to show you my deck here right now, you can take a look at it. One of the folders that I have right now and some other stuff you can do the same thing with it if you go ahead and navigate to under the settings so once you download the tweak you can make that the way that i show you guys with your DAC, with your folder with your widgets with your notification and also the lag screen player you can do the same thing with the player and also we have another section comes with the tweak if you want the round corners which is you can and you will be able after you toggle the switch here you can reduce the corner reduce the way you like so once you're done if you make any kind of configuration once you download the tweak go ahead and respring your device so your device will be apply all the changes so the way that i show you guys you can take a look right now my deck and the way that i show you on one of the folder that i have here right now this is how is that will be looks like once again guys this one will be called dusky moving right now to talking about the other one the egg notch you guys can take a look right now for the notch that i have on my jailbroken device this is how is the style after you download that week and even you can do more you can colorize some stuff if you want to go for example into your uh, control center you can take a look even it's going to be colorize the carrier for you once you navigate to under the settings so once you download the tweak, go ahead and navigate to under the settings. One of the options you have the notch color, go ahead and choose the color. You might see right now here, this is the same color that I choose. And the status bar text color, you can leave it as the same as the default comes with a white color. You can uh, change that if you would like to. And the other section, if you want to always show the glitchy, which is you can toggle, untoggle that option from there once you're done make sure to tap on the apply the changes to apply the most of the things that you choose or configure from under the settings and you can take a look right now here even i show you once i launch my control center right now you can take a look how is that will be looks like with a notch with the colors just like that once again guys this one will be called the egg notch and moving right now to talking about the other C that we the custom SW. This is gonna be configure and make you to customize some stuff for your multitasking or your switcher. Let's go ahead right now and navigate to under the settings. So once you download the tweak, you have one of the options if you want the normal switcher card, the size you can toggle that, and also underneath that it will give you the size and how the style you want it for your switcher so we have the original one which is the uh, default one and we have the super tiny the tiny the small medium normal and large and extra large and also we have different kind of section for the grid style the grid style small or the large for me my opinion the large one i can take a look for everything so i choose the large one and also we have another toggle if you want the double grid style this is only gonna work for ios 12 it's not gonna be work for ios 13 up to 13.4 so pay attention for that also we have another section if you want to show the status bar on the switcher and also add some animation if you want to other stuff like if you want to hide the title, if you want to hide the icon, if you want to remove the background blur. And this is the most of the things comes with that section. 
other section will be for the switcher background color if you toggle that that will be allow you to choose your color so you can tap on choose your color and you can pick the favorite color that you want to put on the background once you're done make sure to respring your device so your device will be take the effect this is what the tweak will be provide you with once again this one will be called the custom sw okay so let's go ahead right now to move and talking about the other cd tweak that i have for you guys so the other one will be called the owip let's go ahead right now to showing you guys what the tweak will be provide you with and what is that tweak will be giving you and what kind of customized stuff comes with that tweak so basically let me explain to you guys what the tweak will be provide you with and what is the tweak it's all about it's all about system wide you can colorize different kind of things once you download that tweak and you guys can take a look right now here that the tweak comes with different kind of style a lot of stuff you can configure that once you download the tweak so once you download the tweak go ahead first of all enable the tweak one of the section is going to be for the status bar of sure so if you want the battery color go ahead and change that the full color and the bars color and the wi-fi color and other stuff comes under the status bar the other section will be if you want the alert color go ahead and toggle that section this will be allow you to colorize the alert background color and also we have the alert label and the alert title and also the alert message label color so you can choose those by basically just tap on the color here you can uh, choose your favorite color and you will be done the other section will be for if you want to enable the switcher color so the switch color if you want to uh, change the color for your switch you will be able after you toggle that section and that will be allow you to color eye and choose the section color by choosing your color from in there of course the other section will be if you want to enable the system color so if you want to enable the system color go ahead first of all toggle that that will be giving you a chance to choose your color of course from in there the other section will be allow you to enable the dots color so you can toggle that and that will be giving you two different kind of options the first one the current dots color and the dots color so you might know because we have different kind of dots here at the bottom so you can choose that and then you can make it different kind of things two different kind of color from that section okay so the last section will be make you to enable the label color so once you toggle that section that will be giving you a chance to choose your color and then you can tap on the color you can make that happen and once you're done this is the most of the things comes with that week you need to make sure to respring your device from the top here and you will be good to go this is how is that week will be bring the most of the things make you to customize some of the things comes with your iphone just like that so this is what the tweak will be provide you with and as i told you guys this will be a system wide will be make you to colorize some of the things comes or most of the things comes in your jelly broken device and once again guys this one will be called the owip okay so let's go ahead right now to showing you guys and share with you guys one of the new widget that i found for you guys so of course if i'm talking about the widget i need to go ahead right now and launch the xn html in order to make this one working i'm gonna be choose the home screen because this one will be for the home screen it will be around your deck let me show you guys right now and look for the name the name for this one will be the module dock so if i want to choose that right now you can take a look at it how is that will be looks like if i want to bring that all the way to the bottom as i told you guys this will be for your deck around your deck let me show you guys so you guys can take a look right now how is that will be looks like it's going to be around your deck and it will be giving you the mac os style comes with the time comes with the battery the percentage the day and something like that if i go back right now and tap on the widget settings here let's see what the widget comes with so we have the icon set which is the weather 
if you want the widget it comes with 24 hours you can choose that or if you want to toggle on toggle that the way you like the pad from in here you can toggle that the refresh and this is the some of the things that comes with that widget that's all if you want to change something you need to make sure to tap on save here at the top and you will be good to go so this is how is the style will be looks like and this is how is that widget which is i highly recommend you guys to give it a try it is nice and beautiful around your deck and this is how is that style will be looks like once again guys if you guys looking to download this one this one will be called the madwell deck so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you like the video make sure to give the video a big thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever i release a new cd8 weeks video catch you with the next one peace out